The Multicultural Mural Project is a student-led initiative. The project came to be about three years ago when student leaders of the various multicultural student organizations came together to talk about diversity, inclusion, and their experiences on campus. I think this mural is such an amazing idea uh, to bring a sense of inclusivity and a really strong presence to the Oshkosh community for all of our um, multicultural students on campus. I thought, well, music is a universal language, so why not create something music related? It's kind of representation that um, we're all in this together. The process with the mural was I worked on 12 four by eight foot boards, three quarter inch plywood, uh, each weighing 60 pounds to begin with, probably 75 pounds each once uh, primer, paint, and all that, and clear coat got put on. And so total, the mural probably weighs about 800 pounds. Uh, I was able to work in each section separately and then kind of line them up side by side to make sure they were all connected. It took a lot longer than initially anticipated. It, I mean, I think it started my sophomore or junior year, and I mean, it's just now finishing now and I'm already graduated, so I'm extremely happy that, you know, more students were able to step up and get this project uh, finished up, and I'm super excited to uh, see what kind of impact it has on, on campus. For me, this mural is important because it will leave a mark on this campus. For the generations to come, voices will be heard, and those voices will be recognized as important and essential to this campus. This is so important to me because it is to uplift and recognize the communities that we have on campus, as well as symbolizes the differences that we have amongst each other and create unity. I hope that this project initiates more in the near future to make our campus more colorful. Keeping it bright and colorful and positive. That was my, my main intention with the multicultural mural because why not, as every culture in the world, get along? <laughs>